comes as we transition into a new phase, nightlife, returning to the valley after a month's long hiatus. Bars finally getting the go ahead to reopen. There are new rules, though, designed to keep you safe and avoid another massive spike like we saw after the first reopening back in May. This time around, the state showing zero tolerance for breaking the rules. ABC 15's Adam Walt stopped by Old Town Scottsdale to see what's different this time around. Zach, Old Town is looking more like a ghost town. Two bars were forced to close, making for a very quiet night, all thanks to the state, which is leaving no wiggle room for new health requirements. This time, Snapchat, the whistleblower, showing what appears to be inside clubs at Old Town Scottsdale with dancing and a disregard for social distancing or masks. Wake up Saturday and the state is cracking down. Casa Amigos and Bottled Blonde slapped with notices first suspending their liquor licenses indefinitely. That would only be raised by the Department of Health Services with a notice that both clubs must close immediately. A different response from the state back on Memorial Day weekend when Old Town looked like this and the governor's response sounded like. I don't go to the clubs in Scottsdale, so uh, uh, you're going to have to ask somebody who's got images, more information on but that. The Arizona Department of Liquor Licenses and Health Services citing violations of dancing, social distancing, standing, and too many people at one table. All part of the Department of Health Services' new health requirements for bars to reopen a second time since the pandemic began. I, I showed up for my first day. Nobody had ever told me that that they were closed down. Which came as news for Evan Jansen, who was supposed to start his security job at Casa Amigos tonight. They weren't even sure when they were going to be open, so it's, um, as soon as they got the green light, they just threw everybody in there said doors are open. We reached out to the management company for both Bottle Blonde and Casa Amigos, and we have not heard back yet. As far as reopening for both of these bars, it's all up to if and when the Department of Health Services says so. In Scottsdale, Adam Waltz, ABC 15, Arizona.